All right, so Bill Peters submitted his resignation letter. The head coach of the Calgary Flames is no longer with the team. Brad Sherliving had a press conference today updating the media and giving a statement of what had happened in what really was a crazy week for this franchise. I don't, I don't know if there was a crazier week since I've been covering this team in terms of the news, in terms of all of the allegations that came forward. But what were some of your main takeaways from this, uh, this press conference today? Well, I think the first takeaway is that this was termed as a resignation. The question all week has been, okay, you know, when is Bill Peters? After the allegations of racism, it was not a question of is he going to be out as coach of the Calgary Flames. It was when uh, he is officially resigned. Uh, now, I guess the saga is over. And, and I think the big answer we heard from Brad Living as Calgary's GM today was, Everyone wanted to know, what did you know when you hired this man to be head coach? He said that, you know, he wasn't aware of any allegations of this sort. Uh, I think that was the biggest thing that I personally heard today. Certainly an emotional day, I think, for Brad Trillivan. I think that he couldn't possibly have known what had occurred 10 years ago in Bill Peters' past as head coach of the Rockford Ice Hogs. Again, it was with a different organization. And then with the physical allegations that came against him, Mikhail Jordan had come forward from the... Uh, Caroline Hurricanes organization and that was corroborated by Rod Brindamore. I think that all was, you know, the way that things trans transpired earlier this week um, all had to be taken into consideration. Another takeaway I took is that Brad Living had such a thorough and and really had to do this right. He had one chance to, um, and, and really there's no playbook, there's no rule book in how to handle a situation like this and I think it was really professionally done. He tried to keep the media up to speed as well as he could in as a timely manner as he could um, but it is what it is and and hopefully now the Flames can move forward with Jeff Ward the associate head coach promoted to the interim head coach today it, interestingly we'll, we'll be hearing lots about what he uh, who he is as a person and who he is as a coach he's been a head coach uh, not at the NHL level but before in the AHL over in Germany and at uh, the um, oh wait, sorry at the AHL level so it's going to be interesting to see how he translates his his coaching skills to the head coaching role of this team. Yeah, and he said the same thing we heard from everyone. This is a, a difficult day for everyone at the South and Brad Living especially wore his emotion. Um, I think everyone is excited to try to put this behind them. There's going to be an NHL investigation. We're going to hear lots more about Bill Peters, but everyone here at the Saddledome kind of anxious to, to move on.